power the God of the Hebrews displayed at the Red Sea that night centuries ago was unbelievable. And the Hebrews, as they came out of the sea and saw the power of God that had divided the sea and then returned it to its place, stood and called him their king. But the God of the Hebrews wasn't finished yet with this people he had selected to be his presence in the world. He had to mold them and shape them. There was a mountain he wanted to take them to. I wonder if they knew about the mountain before they got there. I wonder if Moses told them. Maybe their question was, well, which mountain is it? There's a lot of mountains. And maybe Moses said, it's the mountain with fire on it. Come with me. Let's follow in some ancient sandal prints to what the Bible calls the mountain of God and see how God began to mold his people to be his witness in the world. Come. <laughs> 